Minister of Power, Chief Adebayo Adelabu, has guaranteed that customers currently receiving less than 20 hours of electricity will not be subject to the new tariff. The minister made this assertion during his appearance before the Senate Committee on Power for a one-day investigative hearing on the proposed increase in electricity tariffs by 11 successor electricity distribution companies. He highlighted that the federal government has implemented a new policy aimed at revitalizing the struggling sector, assuring Nigerians that the difficulties they are experiencing are temporary. Furthermore, the minister affirmed that the federal government would allocate 2.9 trillion naira to subsidize electricity this year if the tariff remains unchanged. We estimated that if we retain the tariff at current rates, the government will be needing about 2.9 trillion to subsidize electricity this year. And we looked at the government budget itself. We looked at the provision for subsidy. We discovered and confirmed that government could not afford to pay this. Government budget is 28 trillion naira. 2.9 trillion in subsidy for power sector alone is over 10% of the budget, which is not realistic for us to ask the government to pay. But there are other competing sectors for these limited resources. During the session, Chairman of the Committee, Senator Enyinaya Abaribe, along with all the committee members, inquired about the process of migrating customers from the previous customer classes of residential R1, R2, R3, commercial C1, C2, and demand D1, D2 to different bands. They also sought clarification on whether the band classification adhered to legal provisions. Of utmost importance is to ensure that the provisions of the Electricity Act 2023 as amended are implemented to the letter, particularly sections pertaining to tariffs and subsidies in the sense that the procedures for such increase are strictly followed upon proper consultation. It was brought to the attention of the Senate that the loan was to be given to us, but in return, the, produce, the meters would be imported and we object to that and I'm trying to find out if that situation has changed and the meters are now being locally produced. The development comes on the heels of a recent increase in electricity tariffs for consumers in the Band A category by NERC.